happiness through curiosity on TRS Clips. Uh, have you been following this whole America talking about UFOs thing? Oh, I have. I have. Uh, for the sake of TRS Clips <laughs> and the sake of the audience which wants to hear this from you, it's Tuesday today, right? I believe. Yes. This episode is getting released on Friday. Okay. So this whole American alien UFO thing has happened two or three days ago. Mm -hmm. uh, let's talk a little bit about that sure. just to understand the magnitude of what the world's governments are actually capable of hiding. Mm -hmm. So the Americans, uh, they recently had this disclosure uh, thing or whatever in which various uh, former US government officials came out in public and went on record saying that they have uh, recovered alien artifacts and certain biologics, non-human biologics. So that's the term they used. Uh, so thus far, I think, it, it, and they, they gave this as sworn testimony. So if they have been lying, it means they perjured themselves and they will be liable for punishment of some kind or the other. So they have given this sworn testimony that the, the US government is in possession of alien uh, technology, alien artifacts and non-human biologics or whatever that is. What does that mean, non-human biologics? Uh, so that's, that's a point of contention. Non-human biologics from a layperson's perspective would mean that alien bodies, bodies of alien individuals. But from a scientific perspective, it can also mean grass. Mm. Or it could mean a mushroom, <laughs> it could mean a cat or a pigeon or anything. So they've used a, a vague term which could mean a lot of things. Uh, so it's not really specific. And they've made the claim that they, the US government has alien artifacts. Now, this is a, once again, from my perspective, it's words. We haven't seen any actual evidence of this. I mean, there are lots of UFO sightings and videos and the US government has also, the US military has also released videos of the Tic Tac UFO and, and certain other things. But all I can see is some grainy footage, black and white footage and, and, and words, testimony. But show us an actual artifact. Show us a high quality video. I mean, everyone has that. Everybody has good cameras and all nowadays. Show us a high quality video of this and then make full disclosure. So as far as I'm concerned, I'm still not 100% convinced. I, all I've seen is words. Uh, so I am still a very skeptical person. I still okay. am. I, I want to believe. I want to believe, but I am unable to believe thus far because they have not shown any real hard evidence. Okay. Yeah. Um what about the first two where they said alien artifacts and UFOs? Alien artifacts and uh, biologics. That's it. Two things they've... Two things as far as I about. remember they've, they've okay. uh, spoken about. Alien artifacts is very likely some sort of weaponry or equipment. Or, or a crashed UFO or something like that. You know, mm. crashed uh, craft, spacecraft. That's what it sounds like, alien artifacts. I mean, what else could it be? Okay. Yeah. So a UFO that's come from another galaxy, it's traveled across space, crashes on Earth's body. Hmm. Like after traveling through space, it crashes on Earth's ground. Yeah. How does something crash on Earth in the first place? It's travel through space. Yeah, I mean, uh, to travel, uh, to crash onto the Earth, you need to first of all get into Earth's orbit and then descend through the atmosphere and then make contact with the ground. So if you have a, a, the technology that will allow you to go across star systems and maybe even traverse galaxies, I don't think it would be very hard for you to go and land on a planet. So why would you crash, first of all? <laughs> so yeah, it doesn't make sense to me, but uh, that's what they claim. Or it was friendly aliens and the American Air Force or some Air Force would have shot it down. I'm sure they have the, if they can travel across galaxies or star systems, they can defend themselves from a, against a puny little missile that comes mm. from uh, human technology. Mm. I mean, the technology they would have would be orders of magnitude beyond what we have. It would be technology we can't even imagine that would look like magic to us. So it doesn't really make sense to me that the US government would be able to shoot something down. You know, Have they claimed something like... Uh it's been with them since 10 decades. That's the rumor making the rounds. Uh, yeah, the first ever, if I can remember correctly, the first ever uh, UFO crash or whatever was in, uh, as far as I remember, was 1947, Roswell, New Mexico, in which a flying saucer or some, some UFO of, of some kind was said to have crashed. Uh, initially, it came out in the news, news media and the newspapers that it was a crashed UFO. But then they changed the story to a weather balloon that crashed and that sort of thing. Now, I don't know what is true, what is not. But I, if, if uh, the first uh, uh, artifacts that they, re they recovered, if they were in 1947, that's at least 75 or so years before today. That's like uh, three quarters of a century, if, if that's the case. Why now? Why are they talking about it now? 
that's a question why are they trying to uh, make disclosure now uh, the, given the fact that if they actually have this uh, uh, evidence then they've been concealing it for decades why are they uh, uh, revealing this now and that's a, a question that i am unable to answer is this a distraction are they trying to distract the world's attention from something else that's happening somewhere else i mean it's come out in the news um, in recent times that uh, whenever there was a coup attempt somewhere or something they would uh, release plant stories of ufos and flying saucers in the media to divert the public's attention from something that's really important something that's happening and the us government was involved in that so uh, it's it's often a diversionary tactic to release certain public interest stories that will grab the public imagination to divert attention away from something else but i'm only speculating i don't really know why they are disclosing this now so if you enjoy this video subscribe to trs clips for more